Inmates at Luzira Women's Prison have this morning organized Christmas carols to lighten the Christmas mood as they continue to serve their term. The inmates sang songs that they composed themselves. <laughs> Barbara Nakanwaji, who is left with three years of her 17-year prison sentence for murder, is the choir mistress. Barbara believes music helps to restore hope to inmates. To require your prison here now. Another inmate, Fatuma Katushabe, is also taken up by the festivities, but warned people against committing crimes that may lead them to be incarcerated. Ruzira tujaguza Christmas, resa zinero tunimukujaguza Christmas, tunyu midwa, na yen kubiriza nya bali ye weru, bed de kobambi bale meku jamu komeda de tunyu midwa, na ebi nyiga. During the festive season, religious leaders make it routine to pray with prisoners. Among the prisoners taking part in the prayers is Lydia Atim Draru. Draru is serving a 14-year sentence for killing former Army Commander Major General James Kazini in 2009. Some inmates also express their gratitude to those who care and provide for them during the festive season. The officer in charge of Luzira Women Prison, Stella Nabunya Sendi, explained what Christmas means for many of the inmates. People normally come in, like churches come in, they donate to the prisoners. Prisoners entertain them with Christmas carols, cultural dances. They also share their experiences, the prisoners and the people that are coming in. So when they do that, the prisoners feel comforted. They feel like, even if I'm in prison, we have people who care about us. Although many prisoners miss the freedom and being with family during this season, they can at least find comfort in the small things that give them a sense of normal life.